I'm Ed Cohn with the highlights of the final road game for the New York Cosmos in San Antonio. It was windy to say the least, but Gaston Celerino had a big chance in the first half. Heads it right to goalie Daniel Fernandez. Later it's Fernandez playing the long ball and the Scorpions trying to take advantage here against the Cosmos D. Billy Forbes gets loose, but Hunter Freeman, terrific recovery to thwart that chance. Billy Forbes moved up to left midfielder. We'd hear from him because later in the first half, Scorpions again on the attack. Forbes against Freeman, this time gets by him and beats Jimmy Maurer. Fifth goal for the native of Turks and Caicos, and San Antonio took a one nothing lead into the halftime break. On to the second half, the Cosmos needing three points in this one, needing to equalize. They got a great chance after this foul in the area by number two, Brad Russin. Marco Senna stepping up, nails the PK. Daniel Fernandez yo-yoed around by Senna. A veteran move by the soon-to-be retired Spaniard, and it was all tied in the 62nd minute. Later, another chance for the Cosmos after Joseph Nane foul Senna. This was hard from the former Cosmos defender. Senna, with the strong win, goes low and misses wide. But later, it's Iose off a free kick. Bends it in for his first of the year. Who saw that coming? Iose and the Cosmos had a 2-1 to one lead. So New York looking for insurance, and they almost got it from sub Andres Flores off the post. But the Cosmos win. They're alive for the number one seed. Two to one the final.